In our first video, we talked about how to plan for your two minutes of testimony here at the state legislature. But what happens when your two minutes is over? Well, one of two things happens. Either the chair could say thank you and you sit down, or you hit the bonus round. That's when lawmakers start asking questions and you get to answer. Remember that two minute time limit? That is gone. You can stay up here as long as they're asking questions and the chair allows them to continue doing it. But there's a few things you need to know. First, there's protocol. Representative Smith may be asking the question, but before you can answer, you have to go through the chair. That's because they're responsible for maintaining the decorum of the hearing. So when you answer, you first say Chairman Jones or Chairwoman Jones, looking at them, making sure they're allowing you to continue, and then turning to Representative Smith and saying Representative Smith. Now, some chairs are pretty lax about this, but some are pretty picky, so it's best if you do it right the first time. It's Chairman or Chairwoman Jones looking at them, then turning Representative Smith to give your answer. Answer the questions completely but concisely. Committee hearings can sometimes go on and on and last for hours and hours. Trust me, lawmakers will appreciate it if you're concise and you don't drag your answers out. And if they ask you questions that you don't have the answers for, we'll simply say that. Tell them you'll provide the information later. After all, that's a great opportunity for follow-up. Need more help? Well, look me up at rickdubrol.com.